Okay guys, I to, we are going to be working on doing some jambalaya. And this is one of my old cookbooks that I've kept around for a long time. And uh, so anyhow, I'm going to start off, we're gonna, it, it's going to require some onions. Um, so one large onion chopped, I have about three, two medium and one small. So what I'm going to do is kind of show you the way that I cut onions. And I'll take this onion and I'm going to just come across here. I'm going to take that edge off, that end, okay? And then here, and these, these sweet onions, Vidalia sweet onions, um, sometimes are like pancakes. So you got to try to minimize what you cut off of it, okay? So I just try to skim enough. To get the end off so um, that's kind of what I do now what I do after that is I just go ahead and chop it or slice it in half and then from here I'll take as little of the peel or membrane off that I can because again these things there's not a whole lot of onion on a lot of them unless you get huge ones and that's that's it we're gonna we're gonna use this piece. So again, I'll just take off what I have to in order to get a, a clean onion here. So that's kind of what I wanted to show you how to do the onions. And then uh, just a quickie here is what I'll do is if I'm chopping these, you've already got the natural rings and the layers here. So chopping them like this is all already going to give you the layers on this onion. So you can chop them thin, however you want, um, depending on your recipe and what you're doing. But basically, for our recipe, uh, one large onion chopped. So it doesn't matter how it is chopped, but as long as you have uh, chopped onions. So for me, like I said, I'll usually lay this thing here like this, and I'll just kind of walk around in a half moon circle and cut this because what's going to happen is the natural layering of the onion is going to give me my layers. So that's the way I like doing it. And then you just pull it apart like that. And if you need them, you know, squared or whatever, you can you can do that. Sometimes if I do need them uh, chopped, I'll cut two places here in the onion just like this there's one I'll hold it together and then I'll do what I was doing and what that will do is give me these chunks and again you're you're using the layer of the onion to automatically give you your your cuts so if you just work to the advantage of the way the onion is already grown and made and its own characteristics you'll have less to do and you can just flip it over sometimes it gets falls apart and everything but that's fine you'll get down to enough where you can just do some chopping if you need to all right well i just wanted to share that with you and uh, we are making jambalaya and we will be back uh, with with some more uh, prep and some more cooking <laughs> 